The power of changing oneself lies not in the mind, but in the body and the feelings. Unfortunately, however, our body and our feelings are so constituted that they don't care a jot about anything so long as they are happy. They live for the moment, and their memory is short. The mind alone lives for tomorrow. Each has its own merits. The merit of the mind is that it looks ahead. But it is only the other two that can do. Man has no permanent and unchangeable eye. Every thought, every mood, every desire, every sensation says I. And in each case, it seems to be taken for granted that this I belongs to the whole to the whole man and that a thought, a desire, 